hi my beautiful virgo welcome to my channel goddess of light 1111 if you are new to my channel welcome if you are returning subscribers welcome back this reading is for my lovely virgo sun moon rising venus and jupiter thank you god thank you universe universal energies ancestors spirit guy archangels ascended masters please give my lovely virgo a clear precise honest message for the highest good all right virgo if you are are new to my channel don't forget to hit the like the subscribe button and the notification bell below and if you are returning subscribers welcome back i do appreciate each and every one of you that have been supporting my channel i'm grateful and thankful and i'm sending lots of new love blessing and prosperity your way virgo what are you holding back i feel like you guys are holding back love holding back your emotion Hold, there was something you guys are holding back from, from giving love, from giving, but I felt like Virgo, if <laughs> there's no need for all of that, you guys could be dealing with a Leo, but I feel like you guys are holding back from giving love and receiving love. There's something you guys are definitely try to uh, hold on to. <clears throat> we'll see. Let's see what spirit has to say for you for your other two cards. So at the bottom we have what? Solar plexus chakra. Okay, spirit, what is the message you have for my lovely Virgo? What is the message? So eight of cups. So you guys have um, two eight here. So number 88 could mean something to you guys. Maybe um, from the past you know eight days eight weeks eight months you guys walk away from a relationship and you still hold it on i said i felt like you might have been dealing with someone that is wishy-washy but i felt like this you know that's because the relationship is always zigzag that's because things are never you know good with you guys you guys always have a lot of up and down with this person so that's why you guys choosing to walk away this time and you not only walking away but you are holding back message a message for virgo spirit what do you have for virgo so we have definitely and the thing is that we have the hermit so you guys are meditating and praying for something new once you release i feel like you guys are transforming you release thought process negativity negative people um whatever this end you have the death card here you release something but now your ancestors and your spirit guy i feel like you have been guided and protected to have a new relationship here with the hermits so you guys are trying to uh, figure a way to have a better relationship a relationship that is good for you so that's what i'm feeling here with the hermit so you guys are definitely seeking answers you try to find the truth you find some type of answers you are seeking oh dreams are coming true oh wow virgo look at that your dreams and wish and desires are coming true yes there could be you know someone that is coming towards you guys someone that is nurturing loving caring you know someone that is very stable very grand it's also very very abundance so this could be someone it could be someone you guys have children with you guys feel like this person is um this person is your dream and wish come true but i feel like whatever you are you guys desire you are gonna get it and stuff so you might be holding back because you want this person to be specific all right message for virgo message for this person virgo is dealing with but your dreams and wish are coming true yeah you guys are definitely your release your ex so you guys are releasing so that's beautiful I love this card. It's fluent to release the X, so I might as well just leave it there. So I feel like you guys are releasing someone. Here, you guys ended a relationship and released someone. Attraction. So yeah, someone is very attracted to you. Someone have a lot of attraction for you. But you still feel like you need to release this person. I feel like you, because you guys want a relationship here. And guess what? Coming towards you guys no love so you have no beginning in love because you guys chose to walk away and let go of relationship here so there's no love coming towards you guys i'm loving this energy there is some because you guys holding back there could be no love coming towards you guys you guys are also 
um, holding back, holding something because um, of what happened to you and an ex. But I feel like there's someone that's there's no love coming towards you guys. You guys are going to have to be opened up a little bit and stuff because you guys are seeking um, answers and try to figure out why you're not getting new love so if you guys are trying to find a reason why the new love is coming chemistry there is a strong magnetic attraction here by you releasing your ex dream your dream and wish and aspirations your desires they are coming true virgo someone is here is coming for you no love comes for you guys show me the energy of the person virgo is dealing with spirit so your cards just flew out. Four of coins. Someone is holding on to you for dear life. I don't know why, you know, this person is holding on to you. You hold them back from them, they hold it on to you. That's what I'm feeling here. Yes, yeah, someone from your past, six of cups. There's someone from your past that is holding on to you for dear life. Uh-huh. So we have five of coins and a reverse so this person they're not feeling left out in the cold they let go i feel like this person let go of the ending let's go feeling abandoned that they, they let go but they still want to be with you this person is holding on to you for whatever reason but i feel like you guys also holding back from someone here because you guys got release your ex what is this person want Virgo to know? What is this person want Virgo to know? So you could be dealing with an air sign that is standing the ground. So whomever this is, it could be a uh, <clears throat> knight of swords. Someone want to speak with you. This person, like I said, this is this person is no longer feeling in a lag. They're not they're not sitting around pondering and wondering and things like that this is someone that you know they are trying to i feel like this person is releasing the fact that they're feeling left out in the cold but now this person is holding on to you they might still want the relationship they might this person is still in your energy they hold it on to you for their life for whatever reason queen of swords it could be a uh, libra gemini aquarius that's you know i feel like there's unfinished business between you guys with the knight of wands here this is someone they want some type of answers this person wants some type of truth some type of clarity what is this person want to say to virgo what is the one to say to virgo yeah they want a second chance with you this is someone that wow whoo. what is this person want to say to you they want someone in here is trying to i feel like this person is trying to release some type of negativity because they are single i feel like someone in here this is someone that want a stable relationship with you but this person might be a little bit manipulative in a way that's what i'm feeling here this person might be a little bit what they want to say to you is the devil in a reverse so someone in here might be you know for some of you this person could be still manipulative but they want a second chance with you this person might be a little bit obsessed with you, possesses and stuff, but I feel like this person is trying to release some type of negativity here. They try to release their addiction. They are trying. With the seven of wands, they might be feeling like they are blacks. There's a lot of blockage between you and this person. If Whether you know it or not, so I feel like you guys are blocking people. You guys are blocking people. But I feel like, you know, there might be even spiritual blockages and stuff like that. Like I said, this is someone that might be a little bit manipulative, a little bit obsessive and stuff. But this is someone that is, you know, um, single and stuff that wants to be with you. They want a second chance with you. They want a renewal with you. Let's clarify the devil in a row first. Clarify the devil for me, spirit. So... Yes, I'm telling you, this person is definitely, they want some type of stability, but they are, they are putting ending into some type of home, some type of, this person might lost their home, they might have to move out and stuff, but they still want to give in receiving love with you. Like I said, this is whomever this is, it could be a Capricorn 
for what we know but i feel like whoever this person here they had to move they could have lose their home they, they lose the stability they have to home but this is someone that is this person could be manipulative they could be they have some type of obsessive that where they wants to be with you and feeling like they are single because they want a second chance with you let's clarify the judgment clarify the judgment please for virgo clarify judgment queen of swords so yes there's an air sign that want a second chance with you this person is juggling whether they should sending you a message or not whether they they have this person attracted to you but they are they are struggling this is this person want balance they are struggling whether they should send you some type of message because whoever this air sign they still have feelings for you they still want some relationship with you here because they want the reciprocity they want giving and receiving love with you here Clef had a knight of wands. Clef had a knight of wands. Clef had a knight of wands. Here, one more card for the knight of wands. Yeah, they want, you know, a passionate new beginning with you. This person is sad. They're thinking about you a lot. I feel like this person is definitely, you are in this person my 24-7. They are thinking about you a lot. There's no one else this person want to have. Someone in here might be a little bit sad, miserable. <clears throat> lonely and stuff like that but this person cannot stop thinking about you they want this new beginning with you they're thinking about the good time they're thinking about when you guys have fun with each other with the two of swords here they are trying to make some type of decision because like i said this is someone that is thinking about you a lot here clarify the six of cups for virgo clarify the six of cups I'm telling you, this devil is persistent. It could be a Capricorn, but I feel like whomever this person here, this devil is persistent. This is someone that is obsessed, addicted to you. They want to offer you something. They want something stable with you, but they feel like things is moving very slow. The Knight of Pentacles here, this person could be want to partner in with you. They, they definitely want a relationship with you here. But whomever this is and stuff, I feel like they are working a way to find wish fulfillment. They feel like you, someone felt like, felt like you walk away. And the more you walk away and stuff like that, the more they obsessed on being with you. The more they are obsessed on being with you, Virgo. If you walk away from this person, they're a little bit upset you left them. So because of that and stuff, they're very persistent. They they uh, continue to they wants to be with you here. They I feel like because we have the devil here twice. This person is holding on to you because they felt like you guys have some type of strong bondage. You guys in some type of bondage together, and they don't wanna be without you here. Hmm. Clarify the Queen of Swords. Yeah, they stress out. Someone stress out. This person is stressed out. You might giving you might giving to someone else. You might be entertaining this Queen of Pentacles here. I feel like this person is stressed out that you might be entertaining someone else. That's what I'm feeling here, that you are happy without them. They stress out. You are entertaining other people. You are happy without them. Clarify the Knight of Coins. See, this person felt like there's people who are competing for you. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. So people are, someone feel like people are competing for you. They see, they are coming towards you, Virgo. This person is at a distance from you. They feel like there's people that are competing for your attention. I feel like people in general are going to competing for your love. Virgo, there's people that's going to competing for your love here. They stress out. They hold it on to you. They feel like you are happy with them. Out them. That's what I'm saying. Your wish 
your wish and dreams are coming true people are going to competing for your love competing for your attention you are getting you are getting attention from other people and stuff like that there's people that are obsessed with you here whomever they are but i feel like this person is definitely worried and stressed whomever this queen of swords here they are worried and stressed you are happy without them you are getting other people attention you are giving other people attention and this justice is at the bottom so someone could be wanting to give you some type of justice they want to come and told you guys for justice all right virgo that's too many i see someone say that you are my two of cups you are my oh <laughs> i said it and look what come out you are my two of cups you are my soulmate yep i'm literally hearing someone say that in my head someone say that you are my two of cups you are my soulmate and before i even said it and the cards flew out of my all of the decks in my hand wow wow what a <laughs> what a confirmation thank you spirit i hear a million voices in my head telling me the things that i should have said so you know whatever this person was supposed to tell you they regret not saying it i'm lost right now i'm confused so yes this person might be confused they worry they stress out they have anxiety sleepless night because they feel like you are happy you you are getting attention from other people people are competing for you and they feel like they have to live in a rut and stuff and the more this person is not around you the more obsessed they are with you that's what i'm feeling here because they feel like you guys are, you guys are have some type of bondage together you guys are a soulmate so they are main focus their obsession with you because because they have some type of bondage with you that's why they're obsessed with you you have click and soul and release definitely an, an energy for you to raise your vibration virgo to release this person and free yourself from this person because there's no love coming towards you guys so it doesn't matter how many people that's giving you attention there someone in here they stress out that the fact that you might be happy without them because this person is obsessed with you but yes you are getting you might that's what they say that's what they say you are getting attention people are competing for your attention and inner child healing so this person might have to do some inner child healings in order for them to be able to focus on getting new love not just uh focus on you here oh i'm a beautiful virgo that's all i have for you guys don't forget to like subscribe and share the video bye virgo